happened. He actually helicoptered in uh, to St. Martin. We had been trying this year to add a art track this year. We didn't think it was going to happen, but we managed to finally close the deal. And to lead the art track, please welcome to the stage Swiss horror artist H.R. Giger. <laughs> HR? Hans Rudy. Hans Rudy. That is my name. And if you can explain, HR Giger, among many other things, designed the alien from the alien film. The xenomorph from Aliens. <laughs> Who is really my representation of what is good about mankind. <laughs> also, people say, hey Hans Rudy, what are you doing on a party cruise? And I say, I like it. Um, the sun is great insofar as that we can have the lack of sun to turn my skin the color of a white quartz countertop in the kitchen of Lady Death. Okay? Uh, sounds good to me. Okay. So I'm going to be going through the schedule and where appropriate, because I don't know what he has programmed, but where it is appropriate in the time you can just chime in with your events. Absolutely. Um, now? Not yet. Uh, how about now? Sure. <laughs> well, track number one in the Jamaica room near the gaming tables. I will be doing throw an octopus at a piece of butcher paper to see what kind of Rorschach splat you can get. <laughs> All of these arts taken for granted will be in the wee morning hours. <laughs> uh, this evening, at 7.30 in the Star Lounge, uh, in conversation with N.K. Jemison on our writing track. At 8.30 in the same location, the Life Online panel. Uh, let's see, 8.45 at the main pool. You'll be a big fan of this one. It's the Fancy Pants Parade. Yes, that's right. I am the Grand Marshal. I will have, will have stitched my own fancy pants but it will be more of a salon to celebrate the culture of the island peoples. What will the pants be made of? Um, burlap. <laughs> Onyx burlap with little ebony beads that I have hand embroidered with my own three hands. <laughs> I have like a quattro hand that comes from my belly. Okay? This, this comes as no surprise. Uh, immediately following the Fancy Pants Parade is Movie Night with... Aliens? No. <laughs> um, Very close. A Prometheus. <laughs> Mimic. Yogurt. Y yogurt? <laughs> We're having yogurt? Sure, we'll have a special black yogurt made for you. Okay. <laughs> Movie Night will be featuring the Iron Giant. Okay, yeah, I guess that'll be alright. And then Galaxy Quest. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And at 10 p.m. in the Star Lounge, Jim Boja plays a bunch of stuff on ukulele and then for some reason plays the entirety of Side 2 of the White Album. I love everything about that album but the color. <laughs> but yet I hate the Metallica's Black Album, so I don't know what to say. Tomorrow morning at 10 a.m. in the St. Oh, Thomas Room. Morning. Oh. <laughs> Let us never have morning and be done with it. Yeah! You, you might want to speak to our king and make a proclamation as such. King, king, please, the kill morning, kill morning. <laughs> These people are my people. At 10 a.m. in the St. Thomas Room, Michael Ian Black will be doing a reading, Q&A, and signing of his book. The name of which I should remember, but I have not eaten lunch, so screw it. I love him. Navel gazing. He is Mr. Peepers. Navel gazing. You love navels. I do. You have six, right? I have each a navel like a porthole on the keel of a ship. And through each little navel peeks out a tiny inchworm, one named Helmut, the other five are named Sven. <laughs> I have yet to meet the perfect lady with female inchworms in her belly, and so we could have some sort of horrible communion. Oh, no. This is all just 
for me. I really couldn't care less whether you were enjoying this. Uh, at, also at 10 a.m. in Oliver Twist, and Kate Jemison is holding her office hours. Uh, at 12 noon in Oliver Twist is the I Was There Too podcast. Are you familiar with this one? I think it's okay. Yeah, the guy that hosts it is a little too normal for me, I think. He has not enough cryotubes coming from his various places. Go anyway, because you're going to see the lovely Amy Man and Paul F. Tompkins talk about their respective feelings. <laughs> At 1 p.m. in Oliver Twist, Will Wheaton, oh, excuse me, Willie Wheaton will be holding his office hours. He is my king. I swear fealty to Will Wheaton, my king. Uh oh. And that day a great rift was divided among the ship. Do you have any other art uh, events for tomorrow? Yes, tomorrow I will be leading a game of Apollos to Apollos. Please come play. Okay, I have to be going now. Time for my ink bath. And then 2.30 tomorrow, Jonathan Colton and friends here on this stage. And speaking of him, please welcome Jonathan Colton. Hi everybody! <laughs> this is the weird part of the cruise, because now all the ports are gone. Now we're just, this is just us. It's just us here. <laughs> we can't get off. The rest of the world has basically disappeared and ceased to exist. This is your new life. It will be this way forever. Congratulations. Uh, I'm going to keep this very short, because you know who he is. Uh, I missed him like crazy last year. Yeah. I'm glad he's back. Please welcome John Hoffman.